Hi guys, welcome back to Guvi's YouTube channel. We are back with the top 10 tech news of the week. Let's get into the video. Microsoft says US rivals are beginning to use generative AI in offensive cyber operations. An unmanned lunar spacecraft has captured and transmitted data analyzing 10 lunar rocks, a greater than expected achievement that could help provide clues about the origin of the moon, a Japan space agency official said on Wednesday. OpenAI restores ChatGPT services after a massive outage. ChatGPT is up and running after a massive outage which lasted for around one and a half hours. The outage started from from 8 p.m. IST on February 14th and it lasted up to around 10.30 p.m. SpaceX to bring down 100 old Starlink satellites to keep space safe and sustainable. SpaceX plans to deorbit 100 additional Starlink satellites out of the 6,000 already launched to stop them from turning into space junk. Longest serving Apple designer to depart, disbanding Ives' original team. Bart Andre, one of the last links to Apple's iconic design team under Johnny Ive, is set to retire after 30 plus years at the company. Chat with RTX, AI chatbot runs locally on your PC using NVIDIA GPUs. NVIDIA brings powerful AI chatbot capabilities to your PC with new Chat with RTX software. ChatGPT can now remember what you like and how you want it to talk. The feature is undergoing testing at the moment and OpenAI hasn't specified when it will be rolled out widely as of yet. Mark Zuckerberg reviews Apple's Vision Pro, calls Meta's Quest 3 better, lighter and comfortable. Meta CEO claims Quest 3 outperforms the pricier Vision Pro in comfort, performance and content library calling it the better product. Epic Foundation unveils the first designed in India education tablet powered by Bharat GPT. The indigenously designed Milky Way tablet is AI-powered and comes with a variety of use cases. Most importantly, it is repairable and upgradable. OpenAI CEO warns that societal misalignments could make artificial intelligence dangerous. Sam Altman, speaking at the World Government Summit in Dubai, reiterated his call for a body like the International Atomic Energy Agency to be created to oversee AI. Hope you got updated with this week's top 10 tech news. For more such videos, make sure to subscribe to Guvi.